Hello, my warrior love. Welcome to Love Notes, your weekly dose of audio affirmations that inspire and nurture new ways of thinking and being. I'm Jessica Flint, founder of Recovery Warriors, and you are listening to one of the many shows on our podcast channel created specifically for warriors like you at all the stages and phases of recovery. By subscribing to this show and taking time to listen to these audio affirmations, you are saying yes to new ways of seeing the world within you and around you. Beliefs can change, and so can you. Let's get started. Before we hop into the love notes, I just want to share one thing with you. And this was a total mind blow for me, because when I discovered that one weekly therapy session, one weekly therapy session is only 0.6% of your week. So in other words, that means if you just go to weekly therapy, 99.4% of your week, you are on your own when it comes to your eating disorder recovery. And I remember what that was like. It was lonely, and that's when I needed support the most. And this is why we created the Courage Club. This is why it exists, to give you the accountability and structure you need to maintain a strong and active recovery. Now, if you want in on the Courage Club, we only open doors at specific times each year and we only invite in people from our wait list little by little because we do something very special where we organize you into hand-matched accountability pods. This has been our secret sauce to transformation. To get on the wait list, go to www.jointhecourageclub.com. Food is not the enemy. Food is not the enemy. I thank food for nourishing me and giving me energy. I thank food for nourishing me and giving me energy. I release all negative thoughts about the foods I've had and let go of worry. I release all negative thoughts about the foods I've had and let go of worry. I choose to release myself from diet focused thoughts that no longer serve me. I choose to release myself from diet-focused thoughts that no longer serve me. Foods are not good or bad. They nourish my body in different ways. Foods are not good or bad. They nourish my body in different ways. I inhale peace. I exhale fear. I inhale peace. I exhale fear. I inhale confidence. I exhale worry. I inhale confidence. I exhale worry. This one meal can't hurt or harm me. This one meal can't hurt or harm me. It is safe to eat. It is safe to eat. My body needs and deserves food. My body needs and deserves food. My attitude towards food is constantly evolving to a more positive state. 
My attitude towards food is constantly evolving to a more positive state. I am allowed to eat the foods that I want whenever I want them. I am allowed to eat the foods that I want whenever I want them. My food choices do not determine my worth. My food choices do not determine my worth. There is no such thing as eating perfectly. There is no such thing as eating perfectly. All foods fit. I am done with diet culture. All foods fit. I am done with diet culture. I am learning to nourish myself in ways that feel good. I am learning to nourish myself in ways that feel good. This moment isn't easy. I choose to be gentle with myself and breathe through the discomfort. This too shall pass. This moment isn't easy. I choose to be gentle with myself and breathe through the discomfort. This too shall pass. It is okay to enjoy food. Food is meant to be pleasurable. It is okay to enjoy food. Food is meant to be pleasurable. Overeating does not make me a bad person. I simply misread my hunger cues and will listen more carefully in the future. Overeating does not make me a bad person. I simply misread my hunger cues and will listen more carefully in the future. I am learning to listen to and trust my body. I am learning to listen to and trust my body. By feeding myself regularly, my body is learning to trust me again. By feeding myself regularly, my body is learning to trust me again. I need and deserve adult size portions of food. I need and deserve adult sized portions of food. It's perfectly okay to eat foods that I enjoy the taste of. It's perfectly okay to eat foods that I enjoy the taste of. I trust my body. My body knows what to do. I trust my body. My body knows what to do. I'm getting better and better every day at listening to what my body needs. I'm getting better and better every day at listening to what my body needs. This sensation will pass. This feeling will pass. This sensation will pass. This feeling will pass. I respect and accept myself no matter what. I respect 
and accept myself no matter what. Food will help me to regain my health and all I have to do is enjoy it. Food will help me to regain my health and all I have to do is enjoy it. I need to eat to satisfy my hunger and it is not important whether other people eat the same amount as me or not. I need to eat to satisfy my hunger and it is not important whether other people eat the same amount as me or not. Food is more than fuel. Food is comfort, flavor, culture, creativity, fun, and a means to connect. Food is more than fuel. Food is comfort, flavor, culture, creativity, fun, and a means to connect. Food brings me closer to freedom. There is nothing to fear in food. Food brings me closer to freedom. There is nothing to fear in food. There is a guilt-free, normal eater inside me, and day by day, I let her show me the way. There is a guilt-free, normal eater inside me, and day by day, I let her show me the way. By eating and nourishing my body, I am choosing a life free from the eating disorder. By eating and nourishing my body, I am choosing a life free from the eating disorder. Well done. You've successfully nourished your mind and nurtured new neural pathways that support the person you're becoming. Please be patient and compassionate with the process. It takes time to anchor your roots into new ways of thinking and being. If you've enjoyed this specific set of affirmations, you can find them in written form at recoverywarriors.com. And to make it super easy for you, we included the link to this affirmation set below in the episode notes there. So you can just click on the link and get access to all of these affirmations. And on a final note, if these love notes are helping you, please share them privately with a friend, publicly on social media, or with a member of your treatment team. The more love we can share and spread, the better. And until our next love note, may compassion light the path you are on and courage keep you on it. You totally got this, warrior.